today is the day, the day we've been waiting for for a very long time. Aquarium at the Boardwalk is finally open. This is opening day. And as you can see, there's still construction going on behind me. They're still building the giant octopus. And hey, this guy lights up at night. It's pretty cool. But we're going to take a look inside right now. Are you excited? I couldn't be more excited. Oh my gosh. I'm actually really excited. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited. It's been a long time we've been watching this thing be built, so we're yeah. excited to take a peek. We, we always wish things in Branson would get built like 10 times faster than they are because it, it takes forever. It always takes a little longer than we hope for, but, but here it is, opening day. Hey, hey, tell people about kind of what we're looking at here. Okay, back here is Branson Boardwalk, and the rumor is this is going to be a really cool space in there. That's where the, where are you? I'm where back are here. You? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> That used to be the giant, now now the name is escaping me, the old theater that was there. Yeah, the Grand Palace. The Grand Palace, the giant Grand we Palace. Have such, we, have, we have really solid memories of the Grand Palace. Oh, that was- We do, we, I, mm, we saw the Rockettes The Rockettes there. and that so many other so shows. Awesome. That place is amazing. Yes, and so that's what used to be there. In fact, it's still behind there, I think. But they are turning into this really cool kind of interactive kind of place to maybe shop, eat, and inter be entertained. That sort of thing is the rumor. And I don't know when that's going to be opening, but th there are plans for that space. But in the meantime, let's check out the aquarium. Yeah, let's go. Like that guy looks so real. He gets me every time. Every time? Well, earlier today when I came to pick up the tickets, he got me. <laughs> so Amy, tell people kind of how the ticket thing works right now. You can buy in advance, right? Yes, and so right now they're doing time slots. And so you need to have a ticket with a timed entry. So now you can walk in if you want and you can hope that there's going to be spots, but we highly recommend booking in advance. As part of their safety precautions, they are not taking cash, they're only taking credit and debit cards. And you can either do that here or you can do that online in advance. But you're going to make sure that you have tickets so you See don't- those tickets. So that you don't come and realize that there's no space for you. Okay, so we went through the ticket booth and then we got our photos taken. I think they're gonna add, you know, probably fun background and show this to us later. But what I'm noticing is that this is a really cute circus theme, which is not something you would expect at an aquarium, but I love it. It's adorable. So like you're on a boardwalk, so it's got that boardwalk feel, you know, and they've got the carousel and they've got all the little shops and you know, arcade, all that stuff. So it is, it's like they themed it around a boardwalk and kind of have that carnival, you know, thing going hey, on. Hey, now they didn't, unless I totally missed it, they didn't do a big uh, grand opening blitz or anything. This was like maybe a soft opening. I, it surprised us. So there's not a whole lot of yeah, people actually, here. It's not packed out. Yeah, it's pretty slow today. Now that's gonna change because this is Monday of Thanksgiving week. And by Wednesday, I bet you it's gonna be packed in town and I'm sure it'll be packed here too. But for today, we um, are getting kind of a nice peak without too many people around. So, but this is really cute. I love the theming that they've done. And I said circus originally, it's not a circus, it's more like a boardwalk. Well, it kind of looks circus-y. Yeah, circus the carnival theme. Carnival, that's a better yeah, word. Yeah, carnival. Yeah, it's awesome. And, and then don't forget the fish. Yeah, you, you kind of like, they're, they're, they kind of match. Like the colors, the blues and yellows and all that, but they're kind of, you know, surrounded by all this stuff. So you almost could just walk right by them, which you wouldn't want to do because it's an aquarium. You want to ride? Can you? Boy, these guys are doing a good job with this, I can tell you already. Submarine adventure, hey. Okay. So then we come in here to a theater, a porthole up there. Whoa, there's water sound. It sounds like we're underwater. Yeah. Look. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's gonna be like one of those four Oh, Hey, <laughs> how are you doing? So up here? Yes, ma'am, right there. In right the there. center. All right, we get the best view. What are we doing, Amy? We're doing on the 40 submarine experience. <laughs> Which way do I turn it? Is this the right way? Oh. Oh, it's so cool. 
you down here? You must be on your way to the gathering place, the most magnificent spot in the ocean. It'd be an honor for me to take you there. Follow me. This way. Oh, no time to babysit right now, Finn. I gotta get these folks to the gathering place before they find themselves in hot water. I can help. I can help. Let me help. Finn, swimming out into these waters before you've mastered your puffing, it's just too dangerous. Puffing's overrated. Check out my stone face snarl. Finn, the goal is to not get eaten. travel.com oh and by the way we hardly ever do this and we need to do it more a big thank you to our patrons what a blessing you guys are to us thank you so much yeah you've got to check this out these are so baby eggs these are shark baby sharks eggs and, and eggs. you can see the the fetus sharks i guess is that what you call them moving inside wow because they're lit up and you can see all the little embryos or whatever it's moving and it's crazy it's like it's like having an ultrasound on a shark game. That is crazy. Oh my goodness. Wow. Never seen anything like that before. First impressions blowing me away. I did not expect it to be this this cool so far. And we just we just got here. Yeah, it's awesome. It's really cool. It's it's a very different type of aquarium than anything I've ever experienced because of the theming. It's almost like an attraction married an aquarium. So usually you go into an aquarium and you know you kind of see the same old thing. You kind of see the, you know you see the fish and you see the tanks and all that, but this is it's kind of like a theme park married a an aquarium or something like that. Yeah. So they did confirm they did confirm that this is a soft opening, so so everyone's able to get a more acclimated, but not only the guests and not only the staff, but also the fish, like the stingrays and how they're they're getting settled in. Yeah, because it'll get busy here within the next few days in town, so it's good to let everybody get used to crowds. It kind of looks like me in the morning. <laughs> is that your hair before you style That's my hair it? and my grumpy face. <laughs> They do look grumpy, don't they? Hey, look at that. You can get in there. You want to go down there? You got the GoPro. Why don't you go down there? Oh, that's You can do right. it. That's okay. Oh, I see. It's got one of those bubbles in there. Oh, I can't do it, man. It's yeah. too tiny. Yeah, it's too tiny. But it's got one of those little bubbles that they can crawl in and then stick their heads up. See? Look at this. That's where, just imagine Amy's face. Hello, hello. <laughs> That's where you would be. If I attempted to crawl through that time. Hey, look, there's a little face. Oh, there, there's somebody in there now. <laughs> Someone who's meant to be in there. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm smiling, but you probably can't tell. I can feel it. Okay. Ooh, look at this. This is cool. 
Glowing waters. Oh, glowing, like, like literally glowing. Yeah, they've got black light in here. Check it out. How do you like this? This is awesome. Ooh, look at the sharks. Speaking of sharks, I like the masks of all the employees. They all look like big grinning shark faces. Oh yeah? I wonder when they brought all of these fish in here. I never saw any big trucks. Yeah, right I don't know. Oh, look, here's an octopus. Oh, uh, yeah. The octopus, he's like the mascot of this place because not only does is he waiting for you out front, welcoming you in, but he also answers the phone and like when I called. Can to, he talk to like eight people at once? That's what he said. He says it's a lot easier to do customer service when you have eight arms. All right. This is cool. Oh, this is like the mermaid section. I read about this. Hey, you can go be a mermaid right there. Protect our curl. Oh yeah. All right. <laughs> A Disney World queue. Yeah, it does. Doesn't it? It reminds me of the Little Mermaid ride queue. Yeah. Hey, here's another kid crawl. Where's the adult crawls? Do they have any adult crawls? I don't think so. I think adults don't like crawling for the most part. I think that's part of it. Oh, look at this. That's Look awesome. at him, he's got his mouth open. He looks like he wants to eat me. He looks scary, doesn't he? Wow. How do they train them to look so scary? It's 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 months and months with the personal <laughs> trainer. Like keep your mouth open, like you want to eat people. Yep. Oh, that's awesome. They're messed, they're not happy. Oh, maybe they're not used to sharing their environment. Oh, there's four, four of them. them. Oh my gosh, I feel there's like I'm in the Little Mermaid. Remember those eels that were part of the, they belonged, they were the pets of, uh, of the big scary octopus lady? I, I don't actually remember that movie. You don't? But yeah, there's the octopus lady and she had eels as pets. Oh yeah, I, re I remember the Disney ride. Yeah. With that octopus lady. So sure they're not kissing? No, they are gonna eat each other. Wonder, what, wonder which one is the uh, the alpha eel. They're gonna have to learn to get along. They're gonna be in there together for a long time. They need to hug it out. So far, I'm very impressed. It is just such a cool place and very great for kids, but I think also fun for us adults. And it looks like we're about to go see all the jellyfish. So, the bloom room. Ooh. Wow. This well, is this cool. is trippy. Yeah, it is. It's all mirrors and lights. Every wow, I don't even know where to walk. I feel like I'm going to run it's into like something. It's like a mirror maze. Yeah. Oh, look at these little jellyfish. See how tiny they are? You have to walk really slow or you're going to run into something. Ah, uh, now we're moving into the kelp forest. Oh, look at this. It's a play area. Oh, how fun. All right, I'm going to sit back and you need to climb up all of that. Wow. Oh, there just aren't very many kids here today, are there? Okay, on your mark, get set, Our go. Our kids would love this. On your mark, get set, go. On your mark, get set, go. I don't think so. But what? how fun! What a great thing. He's going to be red and green. I bet it's going to be flipped, though, isn't it? I don't like know. backwards? Maybe. I feel bad for not having our kids. <laughs> that doesn't look like TPF. Well, it's the best they can do with crayons. Crayons? Crayons. Crayons. 
Crayons. Crayons? Crayons. Well, it's spelled crayons. Leave a comment down below. Is it crayons <laughs> or crayons? And how are they going to comment this? I don't know. They'll have to get. They'll have to sound it out. Okay, I'm almost done. Oh, here. Place your picture oh. upward. Here we go. Oh, that's awesome. And he's going to come out here somewhere. Find your character in the underwater world. Here he comes. Here he comes. Where is he? Right there. Oh, there he is. Yeah, he's backwards. He said it right. Yeah. Well, oh, maybe maybe he flips around and maybe. forwards. He might. There he goes. Oh, there it is. Now it's frontward. Touch the, oh, look, look, John. Oh, yeah. I think you can touch him. Touch him. I will. This guy wants to come up and say hi. Holy cow, he's jumping out of the water. Oh! oh he, what happened? Well, he scared of me. He he uh, swam away and it scared me. Look at over here. This all this started running all of a sudden. What is this this thing? The like water is very cold. These guys are hard like I expect starfish to be. But these big guys are furry. Whoa. They're soft. We're now going to head out to the gift shop and then we'll talk about pricing in just a second. You want to see our pictures, Amy? Oh, yeah. See ya. Get it? Yeah, I do get it. Woo! All right. All right. So what'd you think? That was fun. It was very cute. Very, very well themed. Um, it was an awesome experience. The only thing I would say that um, is maybe I wish it was a little bit longer just because it's so cool, I would have loved to, you know, experience it a little bit longer. But other than that, it was amazing. Let's talk about pricing. So let's see, it was $35 per adult. And if you pay, I believe it's $58, then you can get the fiver. And that is admission to the aquarium and then right down the street, also admission to the Hollywood Wax Museum, the golf course that is there, uh, Castle of Chaos that is there and the Mermaid that is there. So if you want to spend just a little bit extra money, you can do all five of those attractions. Anyway, we hope you enjoyed following along with us for this awesome first peek into the aquarium. We're very happy that it's here. We hope you get a chance to enjoy it soon and safe travels, everyone.